Gaff, we'll start off with the disappointing news, I guess, with the FA Trophy in terms that fans won't be able to join us for the occasion. Just what are your thoughts on the decision? Yeah, it's a massive blow uh, for the fans and for us, not having the fans with us. Um, just the whole you know, journey to Wembley, uh, the anticipation uh, of that big date um, and the Harrogate Town supporters behind us. It's, um, it, it, it's an odd one. I thought we'd waited all this time um, because we had something at the end of it, you know, which was going to be the fans with us. Um, and so galling, knowing that just a few weeks down the line, after that, there will be fans in every stadium. So, a, a really big blow for for all of us at Harrogate Town. Mm. There's a petition going around, obviously, at the moment, but we'll see if that gains some traction to make FA change the decision. But who knows? Mm. Um, against Forest Green, to see um, the way they performed, it was a tight game. Does that give us confidence for the future going forward? Because they are a team which many think will go up this year. Well, when you see they're in the top three, we had a lot of possession. I can't think of many away signs of Forest Green having it as much possession and, and shots as we did. Um, we've got to turn that possession into being more ruthless. Um, I think it was a disappointing afternoon because we underachieved. We, we didn't, although we, we dominated some passages of play, we still played nowhere near what we're capable of um, in terms of de defensively, two sloppy goals, and attacking-wise, we didn't really prize them open. They scored a really good goal, to be fair to them, their second goal, but we didn't do enough to stop them. Um, having said that, when you, you sit back and look at the whole game, um, there was enough there for us to think, well, if we are anything like our best, you know, we're, we are a real match for anyone. And, you know, coming away from there with a, a narrow defeat in many eyes wouldn't be too perturbing, but um, we know we can do even better. Mm. We did get a goal that game and it came from Jay Williams, his first senior goal, and he was playing centre midfield when he came on. Do you think he added something different to that midfield? Yes, yeah, he was uh, looking big and strong in there, but very smooth on the ball. Took a good positions defensively, which I think we, you know, at times we can do a little bit better uh, defensively, you know, out of possession, um, and organise well, you know, for a young lad. But uh, presence in the box, you know, sometimes we, chances go begging in the box for us from set plays. So it's good for him to stick his head on it and really pleased for him. And one man who does continue to impress in midfield is George Thompson, doesn't he? He started on the right but moved centrally and he seems to be really excelling in that central role, doesn't he? I think so. I, I think so. From being um, a good right winger but fl flaky out of possession a couple of years ago to to um, being a really, really solid performer, you know, and uh, more than that, outstanding for us in the middle of the park, you know, um, on the ball and and off the ball, he's, he's winning the ball back for us, he's being physical, he's winning his headers all round, looking really good centre midfielder. Mm. It's more come on Saturday when we played them last time, it was another close game, a narrow 1 0 defeat. But did you see much difference between the teams that day? No, they stuck, uh, they, they got a, a good goal and they scored a good goal, and then they put bodies be, behind the ball and made it very difficult for us. And we were at a, a period of time where we did like that lack that little bit of quality in the final third and um, couldn't manage to prize teams open but we'll be we'll be determined on Saturday you know we know what we've got to do it is a big game for us. Do you think it's a six pointer? It pretty much is really um, when you think that we can claw it back to five points um, and they've had a phenomenal run but it just would blow it wide open really you know if we can get a win and and then add to it after but it certainly gives us a confidence boost. Yeah, if we were to win on Saturday, we'd make it five home wins in a row. What do we need to do well to make that happen? Uh, well, both sides of the game, as discussed. You know, we need to defend better than we did last week as a, as a team and be more cutthroat in front of goal. But um, defensively at home in recent times, we've, we've done well. Um, you know, we'll just be looking to take the game to Morecambe. They're, they're a very good team who've excelled this season. Uh, but we now need to get on another run to, to really make it an exciting end to the season, which we all want. Best of luck. Cheers, thank you.